Hi, it's Richard Mosdell. This is my daily karate vlog number 80. And today's theme is how I got my six karate black belts. Today is Sunday, and I always come in the afternoon, clean the club, uh, putt around, try and get things right. I want the club to look just nice. And in the process, I found all my old black belts. So let's go through and see what they mean each. Let me just flip the camera here. Okay, 1989, I got the first one. And I thought I was in the original Wadokai style in Japan. Um, but in Canada at the time, you couldn't get a black belt with the label so, of the Wadokai. So the only black belts I could get at the time had Japan Karate Association, which is actually a big Shotokan Karate Association, as you know, the Shotokan style. So I wore this black belt for ages as I was teaching. But then when I went to Japan in 1993, people said, hey, because... They would look at my black belt and go, you're Shotokan. I go, no, I'm not. I'm Wado. They're like, no, you're not Wado either. I'm like, oh, that was weird. So I had to start training in the original Wado style in Japan. And in the process, I got myself a very simple black belt. And here, this one's so old that the Wado badge uh, came off. And here, this says, Todomozdel, because I used to go by my middle name. And this says, Wado Kai. Then in 1988, uh, I was back in Japan. I was coming and going, but I was back there. And uh, here's the actual logo, the Wadokai. And here's it says Canada Wadokai. And it, I was starting to use my first name, Richardo T. Mosdell. In 2000, I switched my club name to Kenzen Karate. And so I have the name Kenzen Karate Wadokai on the new belt, and then here just Richardo Mozuderu. And there's the Wadokai badge. And these are all my belts. These ones are from Hirota. My very first one was from Tokaido. And as you can see, this one I got probably the most use out of. I, I wore it the most as I was teaching full time all the time. I went to Japan in 2004, and by 2005, I was a head coach of, and this says, Seiritsu Gakuen Karate Dobu. The Seiritsu Gakuen Karate Club is the oldest in Tokyo. And my name, Richardo Mazuderu. And just for my style, I got Wadokai on it. And as you can see, I, for the 10 years I was there, used it quite a bit. 2014, came back to Canada, opened Kenzen Sports Karate. And as a gift, a different uh, martial arts karate maker called... Shudeido, who I ordered all my uh, karate uniforms in Japan through for my karate club there, they gave me this as a gift. And it says, Masuderu Richardo. Kenzen Sports Karate. That's my six karate belts. And that was 2014, three years ago. So let's see, how often do I normally get a new belt? Well, there's about four years, five years... Two years, four or five years. Well, that was the longest, basically nine years. So this one's still holding up pretty good. Thank you very much, everyone over at Shredito. And uh, I'm going to be using this for quite a while. Oh, there, oh, there's the off. So a karate uniform and a belt, that's just a workout tool. And it's a great signifier for where you're at. But the effort that you put in is most important. And while they go white and people think that's really cool, it's more important just to think about putting in that effort, getting that physical exercise, meeting your friends, having an awesome time. And if you can, come work out with us whenever you want. I'm Richard Mazel. This is my club, Kenzen Sports Karate, and my daily vlog number 80. And tomorrow, going to bring you stuff training with the kids here. Thanks a lot for watching.